Hi, this is Lil Nas X, and this is how I went down with my song, Old Town Road. Yeah. I was going home from school. It was my first year of college. Uh, you know, it was very, very sad year. You know, wasn't too happy about it. I'm supposed to start this math class and retake it, but I don't do that. So uh, what I do is I make a song for Twitter because I have a, like a big Twitter following where I post like memes and stuff. And, um, you know, I put it out and they're like, wow, we like this, this is hard. So I start like making a lot of songs. I'd make about like four or five songs. And then I was like, wait a minute, I want to make music now. So I started making music for that entire summer. I had been at my sister's house for that majority of the summer because I didn't want to go home because my parents were like, why are you wasting time making music or something like that? So, you know, my sister's like pretty much fed up with me being there, I guess. I was like in a place of like, like, what do I do now? So, you know, as any other middle of the night time, which I usually do, I get up, I start searching through beats on YouTube. I go through like maybe a hundred beats or more. I come across this one beat, it like sounds different. I'm like, oh, this beat right here, it slaps. It kind of in a way like relates to my situation of what I wanted to do at the moment, which is like just, just like run away from life in a way. So what I do is I'm like, okay, yeah, I'm gonna take my horse to the Old Town Road and I'm gonna ride till I can't no more. And you know, that's what I said. And I was like, it has to like bring all the things I have going on, which is like, you know, the, the funny meme culture kind of thing, along with hip hop. And let's mix it up and make it different with the country, you know? So let's like put all that into one like ball it up. Let's make sure this song is short, to the point, and it sounds amazing, but it's also funny. So yeah, I went about that month of like switching in and out lyrics, you know, uh, you know, switching in and out melodies and stuff. And then, you know, I started making the entire song. So it was like, you know, I got the horses in the back, horse tack is attached, had his matted black got the boots that's black to match. And I know how to say match. Matty just fits the rhyme scheme better. So I said that. With the second verse, it was like the Hollywood cowboy version of you know where I saw myself going. And it's like riding on a tractor, being all in my bladder, cheating on my baby, you know, money, 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 you know, all the stuff that you hear. So it's like a country spin on classical rap tropes within this generation. Billy Ray came on the song four months, maybe, maybe like four months after the fact, once it like, like, like literally on the day like it hit number one, Billy remix, like we were in the studio like listening to his remix and uh, he hopped on it and killed it. You know, that's what happened.